Hey, this is M with the 33 Secrets, and in this video, I'm gonna answer the question, does having six-pack abs attract beautiful women? There's been a lot of obsession lately with guys and six-pack abs. Everyone wants to know, will it help you attract more beautiful women? The shocking truth is, it will help you in the same way that being rich will help you meet more beautiful women, or being tall will help you meet more beautiful women, or being good looking will help you meet more beautiful women. Of course it'll help you. However, these things I just mentioned should only be used as tools for attracting beautiful women. They should never become the meat of your game. The meat of your game should be your actual game. No matter how rich you are, no matter how tall you are, no matter how good looking you are, and no matter if you have six pack abs. The problem is, most guys who are rich, who are tall, who are good looking, who do have six pack abs, have this tendency to become totally dependent on these things to become the meat of their game. And when you do this, it kills your game and it makes you just as vulnerable and just as powerless as guys who are not rich, not tall, not good looking and don't have six pack abs. Personally, I've taken away many beautiful women, not just me, but my students have also taken away many beautiful women with ease from guys who were very rich, very tall, very good looking, had six pack abs and all. Any normal person would have thought these guys have everything a beautiful woman could ask for. Yet, their women were more than willing to leave them for guys who aren't rich, aren't tall, aren't as good looking as they are, and don't have six pack abs. Why? Because as I've said, these guys, they allow these things to become the meat of their game instead of limiting these things as mere tools for attracting beautiful women because that's all they should be. That's its sole function, to attract more beautiful women into your life. The fact that you're rich, tall, good looking, have six pack abs should never be used as your actual full time method of game because when you do, you will kill your game. You'll stop developing your game. It's like when you drive your car to the grocery store. Your car's function is to take you to the grocery store and take you home after you're done. That's it. It's not your car's function to physically go into the grocery store and do all of your shopping for you. That's where you need to take over because it requires human intelligence. Okay, it's no different with game. Unfortunately, almost every single guy, and I'm not kidding, Almost every single guy I've ever met who's been rich, tall, good looking, has six pack abs, all tend to think that they're above game or that they already have game because they can attract loads of beautiful women relatively easy, regardless of the fact that many of them have a very poor closing ratio. Why? Because many of them can't push a beautiful woman's attraction any further beyond her initial sugar high that she gets from seeing all of his stuff. You know, how rich he is, how tall he is, how good looking he is. They can't push her attraction any further than that because they lack game. And unfortunately, the few beautiful women that they do have sex with, you know, it only reinforces his false belief that he doesn't need game or that he already has it or worse, that he's above it, okay? That he's above game. Understand, no matter how rich, how tall, or how good looking you are, and no matter if you've got six pack abs, no one, and I mean no one, is above game. Including celebrities and professional athletes, even though they too all make the same mistake of thinking that they're above game because they can attract beautiful women with ease. You know, it's usually not until after they end up in the tabloids or their name is you know, out there in the news or they're in divorce court that you get to see for yourself how powerless they actually are without game. And if you don't believe me, just take a look at Mel Gibson, Kobe Bryant, Paul McCartney. I mean, I can go on and on. These are all very rich, very successful, very powerful men who all got taken out of the game by little hot girls half their age. One of them was even missing a leg and she was still able to take down a legendary beetle. And you'll notice 
all of these men I just mentioned, and nearly every man you'll ever see in their position, whether it be money, look, celebrity, fame, all make the same mistake of thinking that they're above game, that they don't need game, or that they already have game, because they can attract beautiful women relatively easy with almost no effort. So they start buying into their own hype, and they get tricked into thinking that, again, they're above game, because beautiful women are attracted to all their stuff. This is actually something I teach you about in the 33 Secrets to Dating Beautiful Women. I mean, I encourage you to become successful. I encourage you to get rich. I encourage you to use your height or your good looks to your full advantage if you happen to have these things because it will make it a thousand times easier to attract loads and loads of beautiful women into your life with very little effort. However, with that said, you should never, ever, ever rely on these things to take full control and become your full-time method of actual game. It's one of the biggest traps you can fall into because at the end of the day, you're still dealing with human interaction. You're still up against basic female psychology. And while all these things make it a thousand times easier to attract hundreds of beautiful women into your life, they won't be enough to take you any further than that beyond her initial sugar high of you being rich, you being tall, you being good looking, or you having six pack abs. You know, when all that finally wears off, and it can wear off very fast, like as soon as you open your mouth, if she starts talking to you and she finds out that you're, you're just a tall, good looking wuss, don't expect her attraction to go any further than that, okay? It's not gonna go any farther than that. So to wrap up, let's answer this question once and for all. Will having six pack abs attract beautiful women into your life? Will it help you? The shocking truth is, it will help you in the same way that being rich will help you, being tall will help you, being good looking will help you. You know, all these things will help you attract beautiful women into your life. Of course it'll help you. It'll help you big time. However, these things should only be used as mere tools for attracting beautiful women. They should never become your full-time method of game, the meat of your game. Because when it does, once she gets past her initial sugar high from seeing all your stuff, she will get bored very fast and her attraction for you will plummet just as fast as it skyrocketed. Understand, you're being rich, tall, good looking, having six pack abs, do not qualify as having game. These are not methods of game. Don't let it trick you into thinking it's game because it's not. These are merely tools, tools for attracting beautiful women into your life. You know, attracting beautiful women into your life by the boatloads, but that's it, okay? That's, that's their only function. Do not become dependent on these tools to become your actual full-time method of game. You know, and don't become dependent on these tools to, to do all the hard work for you, okay? Because when you do, it will kill your game and you'll stop developing your game. You'll stop improving your game, okay? That's the last thing you want. So until next time, this is Am from the 33 Secrets and I'll see you in the next video.